Hello, sir. Morning. Lovely to meet you. Morning, George. Nice to see you. Outside the Aviator Cafe. Yep, you're, you're here at Damien's Hall Aerodrome, and I um, understand you're going to come flying with me today. Yes, and what an exciting challenge this is. What exactly are we up to? Uh, we're going to fly in a microlight aircraft. I'm the chief flight instructor here at uh, Rochester Microlights, and I'm going to take you airborne in a little aircraft over here and uh, teach you how to fly an aeroplane. This is pretty exciting stuff by anybody's standards. And, you know, for people watching at home, this is kind of like dreams come true stuff, right? Um, yes, I do it every day, of course. So. Uh, it's quite normal to me, but uh, yeah, very exciting for a first time. I think you'll find it quite exhilarating. So, for our brides to be grooms to be, this could be a great way of kickstarting a, a Stalgar Hen do a party, oh, uh, right. a quick flight up for them. Absolutely, yeah, great, great adventure, something wonderful to do. So, potential stags and hens at home watching, tell me how the day unfolds. Well, certainly, if, it, if we came down as a group, we would take one or more of them airborne, they can take cameras with them, so um, it's quite safe to take a camera up and film the experience. And those that aren't too keen on flying can actually watch the aircraft and get very close to the runway here, so you can actually see the takeoff and landing very close and then can, can take their photographs. Um, and they can wander off to one of the local pubs if they want, very <laughs> close here to uh, some very nice pubs. Well, on that note, I'm ready to kid up and go. What about you? Yes, let's go flying. Brilliant. Come on then, this way. OK, this is the aircraft we're going to fly today. Um, it's called a Jabiru, actually built in Australia. Really? Crazy enough, yes. All fibreglass, composite aircraft, two-seat, just like a little sports car of the air, really. It is, isn't it? I feel like a VIP already and I haven't even gone up yet. <laughs> OK, so that's enough about the aircraft. Uh, the weather's a bit changeable today, some low clouds, so let's go and get flying before the weather changes. Brilliant. Let's do it. Let's seat up and fly. Right. So... Here we go, everybody at home. I'm ready to pilot my first maiden voyage. Very exciting. There we go, just swing your legs in. And I'll there we go. So. Right, here we go, we're prepping up. Safety checks, safety procedures, almost ready to take flight. OK, can you hear me all right? Yep. That's great. I feel like Brittany. <laughs> <laughs> so where are we going to be heading to, Keith? Uh, initially, when we take off, we're heading south, southwest from here, which will take us straight out over the Thames. You should be able to see London if the weather's not too uh, gloomy. We're back. Keith, that was some kind of experience. Thank you so much. Richard, glad you enjoyed it. I'm speechless, and it's a very, very rare occurrence. It's, you know, I can see why you're addicted. <laughs> I'm glad you enjoyed it. Thank you so much. Right, let's step out, shall we? 
That was wicked. Keith, I am sold. That is some kind of experience. Well, I'm glad you enjoyed it. Yes, it was uh, quite, good, quite good weather up there, so not too bad at all. It's, it's a weird sensation. It is almost like you're floating through the air, and it really does kind of take your breath away in a great way. Oh, certainly. As soon as you leave the ground, there's no great sensation of speed. He's just flying around, just like having your own magic carpet, really. <laughs> it's a bit, isn't it? Yeah. I cannot think of a better way to kick off a party. So, as a first officer, how do you think I did? Did oh, I pass fine. the challenge? Yes, George, you did pass the challenge today. You did go flying, and uh, you did very well. And if you want to take it further, we can teach you here how to become a pilot. Brilliant. So, um, if people want to come down and give it a try at home, how do they, how do they find oh, it? Simply just, just call us up. Um, we're here at Damins Hall Aerodrome in Essex. Uh, just call us up. We're here operational seven days a week. Uh, just come down and have a go. Simple as that. Well, thank you so much for today, Keith. Everybody at home, what can I say? I have done some challenges in my time, but this really is the real deal. Come down and give it a try for your Staggle Hem party.